name's Campbell Bishop and I have Pompe disease. My name is Nicola Goff and I have two little boys with Pompe's disease. My name's Jenna Primmer and my son Nate had infantile offset Pompe. He passed away in 2016 when he was two and a half years old. He was diagnosed with failure to thrive after, I think, probably about two months. Just, he was feeding okay, but he just wasn't quite as strong as other kids would be. He wasn't, you know, starting to try and roll over, things like that. We knew that he wasn't going as well as he should have been, but in hindsight, we didn't realise it was as serious as what it was. I first noticed something with Thomas wasn't quite right. Um, as he would get up off the floor, he would stand up and push off his knees, then walk up his legs, and it was a struggle for him to get off, off the floor. I've had Pompe disease for about six or seven years, diagnosed in year 12, which was 2010. They don't tell you that Pompe is terminal because it's technically not. It's how long is a piece of string, like, you know. Obviously, the earlier kids are treated, the longer they last. So in the end, then we had to do a muscle biopsy. So Thomas had to have a piece of muscle taken out of his leg. So they knew something was wrong, but they weren't quite sure what it was. And the muscle biopsy came back with, with Pompe's disease. So if there had been newborn screening for like Nate when he was born, we obviously would have known within the first two to three weeks of his life. Um, it would have extended his life obviously dramatically. Newborn screening for the government will save them money. It will save them a lot of money. Um, and from a parent's point of view, it could have extended my time with my child. So when we were told that it was Pompeii disease, I think because there was treatment for Pompeii, there was a little bit of hope for us. So we were a little bit relieved. Uh, but then we had to get Balin tested because um, it was a 50% chance that Balin would have it as well. And he came back positive. Now we have two little boys with Pompeii's disease. Mm -hmm. 